Now this illustration deals with the size water pipe and the size grounding electrode conductor suggested or recommended uh, maximum size to be connected to a certain size water pipe system. Now notice in the note, important information now, when sizing the grounding electrode conductors to be connected to metal water pipes, use the recommended guideline below. So it's recommended. It's up to the authority having jurisdiction what, can, what size could be used and what size grounding electrode conductor could be used in accordance with 90.4. We have to deal with the authority having jurisdiction if we're electricians. Now notice we give a recommended size of grounding electrode conductor. Say you were using a number two, which we've used quite a bit in this uh, presentation for 250 kC mill conductors and four alt uh, conductors supplying a service. That number two is suggested you'd have an inch and a quarter water pipe. You say, what about a number six, three quarter? What about, uh, say, uh, three alt or four alt that we might use as a grounding electrode conductor. Maybe a four alt, you increased it in size because of distance, uh, then it'd be two and a half. But if you just used a three alt, the largest grounding electrode conductor required to be connected to a water pipe in accordance with table 250.66, then two and a half inch is recommended. But I would like to uh, call out now, this chart you see here is a recommended chart. It's up to the authority having jurisdiction what he or she will allow conductor size wise for grounding electrode to connect to a metal water pipe. Do not forget that and that's what this figure 16-86.2 is pointing out. 